and the Allen for Applied Shoulder Can. So yesterday with my martial arts loving kids at CP Allen High School, we were looking at some cut the base striking from a clinch. So this is looking at uh, your, your barrage of haymaker punches and we're looking at the opening movement of Kankudai or Kusanku. The Shoulder Can version comes like this around and you go one side or the other side. The Kusanku version, the older version is, is like that, which kind of uh, capitalizes on that instinctive uh, flinch response. So Chen is coming in here and he throws his big bomb. I'm, I'm coming in where I'm safer, okay? And I'm just kind of tucking my chin, shoulders are up, and I'm here. I, I might catch part of the head, I might catch two ar my arms on one arm, doesn't really matter, but I should recognize what that body part is once I hit it by feel. Right away, I wrap this up and I start wailing. So that's the first movement of Hien, uh, sorry, Tanku I wrap up the arm and I start striking the neck. So one more time. Right here, crash in, kind of overhook, start smashing. Now from here, we got away from the cup a little bit. Um, we were starting, we want his posture down to attack the neck. So I hooked my hand over the neck, like that, and I threw a, an oblique kick, and then a knee strike. Or you could, posture back up again, or you could go one, two, all in one kind of motion like that. Once his posture is down, we have a little pull motion here, snap the head, and it's in, in, into a, a guillotine choke. We just did the standard guillotine like this. You can go like that as well if you want to make it look like bas side eye. And for whatever reason, if that wasn't working, maybe you hit a hand part way in. I take this arm and I slap it in. I feed it into the choking arm right here. Okay, from here, I'm going to. Uh, it doesn't have to be a reap. I can kind of just trip it up. But this is going to come from here and stand down with our hands on our fists like that, and we turn our body like that. So this is the was the choking arm. Now I have an arm in. Okay, and this arm is just going to kind of protect that from coming out like this. Uh, if I lean this way, that leg over there gets nice and light, which means he can't move this temporarily. If I keep him here and try to step behind, he, he recognizes that and steps away. Right, so I can come here. Oh, I'm going to do it this time. <laughs> come here, and then if your Uki doesn't cooperate, kick him in the leg, and then do a throw. <laughs> okay, and that's where we finish the drill. Okay, one more time from the top. Hey, here you come. come in, grab up the arm, start wailing. You give it a oblique kick and a knee. Snap the head down, guillotine. If that's not working for any reason, you slap that in. You come here, let go of the head as, they, as you get the throw. Knee on belly. You could wrap it up, do a wrist lock if you want to. Bring the head in. Finish with the arm.